hey beauties welcome back to my channel as you can tell by today's title of the video this is going to be a chit chat girl talk video i'm gonna just be giving y'all life updates and being just talking about my goals if you're new here my name is kaya welcome to my channel welcome to my channel girl usually i just do get ready with me videos or beauty videos or chit chat videos um vlogs here and there so join the fam i hope you do by the end of the video want to join the fam but if you're not new here welcome back welcome back sis let's get into it so last time we talked like i feel like i was telling y'all how like i had i had to get my truck fixed like i was going through um so long story short, I had ended up having an accident where I needed to get work done on my truck and my insurance had to take care of it or whatever. Um, so I went through the whole process with my insurance, went to get um, my car fixed, got my car back and y'all. I'm so, I'm so frustrated about it but it's not that big a deal but it is that big a deal at the same time because it's, it's very very highly inconveniencing to me your girl so anyways got my car back and I basically got my car back I drive a Jeep Cherokee um latitude I think that's what it is but anyways I got my car back from the people woo, woo. I think I went like two weeks Maybe three, maybe just two. I feel like it was just two. I think I went two weeks and then I ended up having to take it back because I kept hearing like my car was just humming. Like it was this humming noise coming from like every time I accelerated or, you know, or even the car was de decelerating, decelerating. Oh, I don't know if that's the word, but even when the car was coming down from acceleration, it was just like this noise and I'm just like what the heck is going on like it wasn't like a tick 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 noise and nothing like that it was like mm, and like humming like you can feel it like it was about to start singing so I'm just sitting here like oh my freaking god let me take it back to these people and just had them look at it so I called them and I'm like I'm hearing humming and they're like no problem just bring it back in whoop -de -whoop. so I bring my car back into these people's facility like i feel like they looked at it for a good 10 minutes and then came to me was just like so turns out um we didn't find everything that was wrong with the car when we first did all the assessment and made all these changes and fixed all this stuff there's actually one more part that's wrong and we need to fix it So I'm sitting there like, okay, um, all I can think of is money. Here we go again. And my car not fixed is what you're telling me. So I'm just like, so how come y'all didn't see that in the beginning? So basically in my head, I'm thinking like, how come they didn't see this in the beginning? Like I'm asking the dude, I'm like, how come y'all didn't see this? I already paid my deductible on my insurance. Like, and I'm not about to file a new claim because then I'm about to pay my deductible again. And so they basically was like, oh no, Miss Tarver, no, Miss Tarver. It was like, no, um, you, we could just attach it to the same claim. So you don't have to pay another thing. And we'll just, you know, cause it's like, under the 30 days blase blase and um because we just didn't see it like sometimes this happens like you don't know what all is you know affected so what you and i'm like oh my god in my head i'm still like that shit don't make no sense how you didn't see it from what the part that they said needed to be fixed i'm like that don't make sense how you didn't check that because that's like directly related to what all was happening but anyway Basically, I was just like, let me just go ahead and take my car home because I could drive it or whatever. And um, I was just figure it out at home because they had bad signal where I was at. It was just a hot mess and I was stressed. So, fast forward to today. So, I am needing them to go ahead and fix it. Like, they're still trying to get the estimate together. But my insurance is already back looped in or whatever. As far as everything else, I'm so blessed. That's why I can't sit up here and be upset and be like, 
so super stressed out and being so like extra about this because honestly i am so freaking blessed like everything else all things considering with what's happening in this in this world right now like i have been super freaking blessed and my family the things that i hold dear to me are god has been watching over them has covered them and has put his hands around them and protected them and i that's why i just be like you know what that's putting it in all into perspective is what be making me like stay sane but it's all good so basically car troubles but my family's great um i mean i'm you <laughs> I'm sure they want stuff, but health-wise, you know, all things considering my family is great and guy just be looking out like I said. So that's a blessing. Work is work, you know, whatever. For August, I did meet five out of six of my five out of five out of six of my goals. So I'm really hyped about that. But honestly, for September though. <laughs> For September, we're getting things together, sis. It's like, it doesn't matter. There's always going to be something that's going on. Life is not going to ever be, like, perfect without stress. That's what I'm getting at. That's what I'm learning. And as an adult, I'm learning, like, life is not going to be without stress. Period. Period, sis. So, um, so things got to get done. You have goals that you want to meet. You, this is honestly filming and doing doing makeup i would say is how i get a lot of i don't know release like it's my hobby like it takes my mind off stuff so i try to do this like it sucks that i can't go nowhere after though when i have like a good beat done but it's okay but what i was gonna say i'm gonna put on these lashes from the hair store i'm gonna put on these lashes and come back because y'all know i can't put on lashes it takes me too long and I don't want to hold up the video. Okay, I'm back from putting on my lashes. Um, and I cannot tell if they are on correctly or not. But hey, it's fine. We're good. We're fine, sis. We're fine. So moving into September, I definitely, um, one of my goals, well, fi my financial goals. So I always set a financial goal because I'm actually saving for a house um among other things <laughs> like right now i got like three saving buckets one is for a house one is for um my sister and i's birthday i'm a twin so my sister and i our birthday is in november so i want i'm saving for to do something for that i don't plan on like going anywhere you, you know sometimes we'll take a trip like we did vegas or whatever but i don't plan on going anywhere like because I'm saving for a house. So, yeah. I don't plan on going nowhere. Also, another goal of mine is to... So, I'm sorry. Let me move back. Let me move back. So, to put towards my um, house budget, I want to um, put away $1,000 towards my house budget. And then also, for my birthday, uh, I just want to put away $200 for that so which is very doable i'm not even being aggressive with these goals um if i just stop buying unnecessary stuff but hey i can't help myself but yeah so i want to do that and then as far as my financial my finances are concerned And then spiritually and with God, I definitely want to meditate. Um, that's something that I want to start doing. I um, have tried meditating, but I don't have the full. I, it's going to come with, with time. And I have I stopped. So I definitely want to meditate 30 minutes a week um, with God. And then... Um, I also want to sign up for a Bible study. I have the app on my phone, the Daily Bread app, because um, at my church in Miami, when I used to go to church, when I used to go to Bible study, my church in Miami, that's what we would do. We would have, we would go off of the Daily Bread, and then, you know, we go from there. But, um, yeah. 
I'm hoping that I can really get into that. Uh, I have to just find a, um, and uh, I want a class and I want to find a, a better app, but I definitely want like a, com a, a service that I can attend. I, in a way, not a service, like a, just a, a Bible study with people, <laughs> even if it's virtual. So if y'all know any, please let me know. But I do want to find that this month. Um, so and those that, that wraps it up for my spiritual goals. I also have like goals every single day to make me a better person. Don't ask me how that's going. But um, what else? And then I have my YouTube goals. I definitely want to increase my following um, this month. So I gave myself the goal of hitting 200 subscribers in September. And I feel like I'm going to. I feel like I can do that. I feel like that's that's doable. Um, so yeah, those are my goals for September. So I'm gonna hold myself accountable, and I plan to do this like every month. We'll see. I have ambitious dreams and ambitious long time goals, like where I see myself in my future very ambitious so if I don't if I don't stay focused on my get, getting these goals done like then what happens is I'm you going it's like you stay stagnant and I hate that and I would love to hear y'all's like goals too like what everybody else goals is Ever since I've learned this technique with the brush, I've literally never like blended any other way. Right, so that wraps up this chit chat video. Thank you guys so much for tuning in and listening to me just ramble basically is what it, what it really was. Let me know in the comment section if you like this look. It's a so basic, like just a basic look for real, for real. <laughs> like it's the basicest look. But I noticed like I need to start doing basic looks when I um like chat because if I don't, the video is just too long because I talk too much and all the steps plus the talking is just too much. So yeah. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to another video. Don't forget to subscribe if you like this video and you like this content. All right, girl, I'm about to um, go eat something because I'm hungry and I got some leftovers from Sugar Factory. So I'm about to go smash that real quick. Thank you guys so much. And I hope y'all enjoyed the rest of your day. And blessings, blessings, blessings to everybody in September. Bye.